that. Supporters of Nairobi gubernatorial seat aspirant Timo Nyonyi are now demanding that the ODM party issues the Westlands Member of Parliament with a direct ticket. This as Jubilee party supporters condemned party leaders for allegedly nominating Polycarp Gathe to fly the party's gubernatorial ticket. Chepto Boyd now reports. <laughs> Supporters of Nairobi gubernatorial aspirant Tim Wanyonyi are now demanding that the ODM party issues him with a direct ticket. The leaders led by ODM Secretary General Edwin Sifuna issued an ultimatum to the party to ensure that happens by the close of business Wednesday, but that has not yet been achieved. <laughs> Tim Wanyonyi was the only applicant who was the governor of Nairobi. She didn't have to pay a ticket to Dani and ODM. The Rafiki Zetu and Dani and Zimi were the same thing. We are 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 the same thing. But at 5 p.m. Timothy had to pay a ticket. He had to pay a ticket. He had to pay a certificate. 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 By close of business today. This comes amid speculations that the Westlands Member of Parliament might have been asked to step down and back another aspirant. This as supporters of Jubilee Party in Nairobi City County aspirants Agnes Kagori and Richard Ngatia camped outside the party's headquarters for the better part of Wednesday in protests over a move by the party to nominate Equity Group Chief Commercial Officer Poli Kapigade to fly the gubernatorial flag in Nairobi County. Political tension is high in the country as the country approaches the 9th August election. The Mulemba nation now says they shall not relent until their own is cleared to vie for the Nairobi gubernatorial seat. Chapter 8, TV 47, Nairobi.